Hey everybody, welcome to Skyline here to review some Arsenal action as we win, beat Napoli 2-0 in the first leg of the quarterfinal of the Europa League. Oh boy, this match was nuts. Because Napoli, I always see as a very strong Italian side. Uh, offense, defense, you know, midfield, they got it all. And, you know, we all, we had one of our players, uh, David Ospina, head over to Napoli um, during the transfer windows here. And really, I just thought this was going to be a very tough test today. And for Arsenal to come out the way they did, it was extremely surprising. Um, because to, to get the goal uh, in the first 15 minutes of this game was truly outstanding. I mean, the build-up to this play was really Ozil to Lacazette to Maitland-Niles, who does this little fucking twirl shit inside the box to pass it right to Ramsey, foots it in, and it's 1-0 to the Arsenal very early on, 14 minutes into the match. And this is where Napoli just kind of faded away, in my opinion, because... Arsenal turned it on, and this relentless pressure that Arsenal dealt with was rewarded with an own goal, 25th minute, and um, Koulibaly, right, is that his name? Koulibaly, Koulibaly, the defender, super highly rated guy, and it looked like this was a Torreira goal, but you look at it and review it again, it's a own goal. But the, the way Torreira tore through the midfield with first intercepting the ball, running through that, you know, final third to get inside of the box to create a disruption that caused an own goal was spectacular. And <clears throat> to get those first two goals in, you know, early in the first half, set, the second half was all about, you know, defensive discipline, um, Petr Cech keeping the net real tight, real close. And having that back three of Mustafi, what was it, Mustafi, Kashoni, um, Socrates, and I apologize, it's actually Monreal because Mustafi wasn't in this match. So Mustafi, not in. Monreal, Kashoni, Socrates in that back three alongside, you know, Kolasinac and Maitland Niles as the wing backs have been, has been a pretty spectacular kind of feed uh, uh, in terms of defense to offense and defense staying relatively high up the pitch. And so with this very dominant win, 2-0 at home, Arsenal looked great. And, and my whole fear is, you know, we go into Napoli next week at their home, how are we going to perform? Because our away form is isn't as great Arsenal's home you know their home form is fantastic you know the, the way they can play at home the way they can dominate teams at home it's great but when they're away <clears throat> this is where the questions come in can Petr Cech maintain composure can the guys generate offense like this like they did today with Aaron Ramsey doing a lot of great things and this is quite simply bittersweet to watch him do this because we know he's leaving at the end of the season but to have him perform like this in critical moments and critical junctures I mean we're in the quarterfinals right now and I'm telling you boys we only need three solid wins to get to the final and you know if you win the Europa League you know final you get, a tr you get a trophy, and you get into the Champions League, and that's the goal this season. So, Arsenal fans, rejoice. This was a successful, this was a huge win, and the boys are going to have a mountainous task next week against Napoli again in the Europa League. So, look out for that. Keep on trucking, Arsenal. Keep on going. Come on, you gunners. Follow me at the Sky Lounge and all links in the description below. Like, comment, subscribe for more daily content. Come on, you gunners. Now fuck off.